what I'm doing. I just vacuumed and there's hair that's still on the carpet, but that's probably because I have papers all over the floor, as you can see. And, um, and I didn't vacuum here and I will have to when the papers are gone. But what am I doing? I'm, I'm doing, finally, at long last, I'm doing my life planning. So I have, I've got all these instructions. I've got literally like dozens of papers from years and years of, of making these, not half-hearted attempts, but like I've, I've done all this life planning uh, you know, from various sources along the way and um, follow different plans and they're all good. And the problem is, of course, me and I don't review the, the product um, regularly enough. And I also feel like I don't finish often enough. So I get started, like I, I start this process and then I don't quite make it to the end. So uh, today, this morning, Ashley um, in the sauna at the gym, wrote me some instructions. And they are right here. And I should take a picture so I don't lose them this time. But, um, but she and has ended up with a binder. Um, it's called a life achievement plan. And she's got a page for each category. She calls it a, uh, what does she call it? An, a lifestyle element. So, so she's got, so as examples, she's got career, relationship, home, spirituality, sexuality, health, um, but she's got 12 of them and she just listed a few and I, I may have different ones than her. I probably will. And, and so there's a whole system of how to go through it. So what I thought I would do, um, in the spirit of decluttering, uh, digitizing, sort of downsizing is actually take all of the stuff that I've written down in the past because it has some value, otherwise I wouldn't have kept it, and, and, and combine it into like a master document, which has really always been my ultimate goal so that I don't have uh, like 100 pieces of paper, each with something important written on it. Um, I just want like one document or, or a life achievement plan binder. So that's the goal, that's what I'm doing. Um, along the way, I also have lists of things I want to do because what will happen is, you know, let's, let's take any piece of paper, this one. So on here, I think this was at a, at a, I think it was on a shoot actually, but I was writing down some stuff that the guy was saying, like I finished taking pictures um, and I was sitting there and listening to him and often the events that I attend and shoot are, are insightful and, and filled with wisdom. And so I was fortunate enough to have the opportunity to write some of this stuff down. And so I did. And so I've got things like finish my LinkedIn course. I mean, that's not really a life goal. It's a to-do list item. I don't even remember what I was taking. Let's put it that way. Um, I've got ideas on here about what I could call a company. Um, I have copy that would be good to use for marketing this future business. Um, yeah, I've got ideas for my personal self. Uh, I've got goals, like vision stuff, like everything. There's like a whole variety of things on this one piece of paper. So that's, it overwhelms me. I keep the piece of paper, um, but I don't, I've, I've never really known what to do with it. But today uh, I'm, I'm taking a, a chunk out of it and I'm going to do my best to put it and all the elements where they're supposed to go so that so that I can compile it properly, like a normal person. Uh, so that's that. And of course, just as I pressed record, my dryer started beeping at me, so I'm just gonna go deal with that right now. And the reason I'm actually recording this at all is because that was a goal from, I guess, a couple of weeks ago. I think I met with Laura, and, and every time I see her, it's inspirational, and I should reach out again. But she said basically, you know, just start doing the thing, right? I want to get into video, I want to get into blogging, I want to start showing my face and editing and showing people who I am and what I do and like the magic behind me. And I mean, it's not that glamorous, but, but here we are. Um, admittedly, I could probably put a bra on for future recordings, but I mean, at the moment, this is just for me and, you know, 
you might never see it, you might, you might not, maybe you can edit this out. Uh, maybe you didn't even notice and I didn't need to even say that. But I'm going to go deal with my dryer and I'll be right back. Well, that was super funny because the stuff uh, wasn't actually dry. So there you go. So if, if I ever do figure out how to use Premiere or, God, even iMovie at this point, then this next part where I record myself working on this, I will fast forward the fuck out of it so that you don't have to sit here and like watch in silence as I look at papers and write shit down. So here we go. I think I need a highlighter. God, getting this highlighter reminded me that I meant to steal a pen from the Doctors of BC because it was one of those cool pens where there was a pen on one end and a highlighter on the other. And I meant to steal one, and I know I could have had one, and I forgot. So obviously I'm gonna have to shoot another thing for them. Oh, and restart my timer. Let's stop recording for now and see what that looks like.